Hello everyone and welcome back to another train simulator video. Uh, we're back, uh, the Cornish Riviera has been diverted down to Falmouth after stormy weather at Penzance has diverted cruise liners elsewhere. Pilot this express train down to Tranquil and Sedate Maritime Line. But yeah, uh, I thought I'd pick this up in the cell. I think it was £3.99 for the Falmouth branch. It may be a very old DLC, I mean it's 11 years old, but still. Still looks very good, sounds very good, um, so I thought I'd pick it up, I mean it was only 3 99 uh, so why not uh, in the Festival of Rail sale. And yeah, it's Steam as well, so it's the first proper run we've had. Steam train. Listen to that. And you may recognise the station as well, this is Truro, so if you've got the West Cornwall local on Train Sim World 2, uh, you've got Austell up there, <coughs> and obviously... Uh, Red roof that way, but we go off down here, so down the middle. I hope we'll do a stream at some point. Um, where we sort of join the two up. Right, have we got the clear? Yes, we have. We're going to be going left. Right, we'll probably spend most of the time on the outside view. If we get stuck, which is very likely, well, we get stuck. <laughs> uh, is that going to put it on? There they go, headlamp on. Uh, so, so that. Uh, I think we have the auto fireman on as well. Well, I would hope we do. I was not going to get very far. Let's go. Listen to that. What a beauty. Right, off we go. Making our way down to Falmouth. I don't know if it's a modern day version of, um, of the Falmouth branch, but I think it's pretty cool. Let's get going. Got to love a good old steam train. Yeah, we've got the auto farming on, so that's all good. Cool. Just 30 miles an hour along here. Look at this. It is proper good. Pick up speed quite nicely, so I'm going to keep it in, uh, we'll keep the regulator at 60. It's a regulator, isn't it? So now it's stuff going. Bring that down slowly. There you go. But yeah, doing a bit more steam in light of the uh, spirit of steam coming uh, to Trainston World 2. But we don't know what the route's going to be yet. Uh, I think actually on the day this video comes out, we do actually get the... Um, news about it, so looking forward to that. Yeah, I'll be interested to see what is beyond uh, Truro while going this way. Another service set. Brilliant. Same sort of class as us, that one. That seems to be... Yeah, I'm going to single track. So yeah, on the modern day West Cornwall, I think all of this is all overgrown. don't think you get this going off here either. I'm guessing this is probably set in the 40s or 50s. They're brilliant. I don't think we get any passenger view. No. Yeah, it's quite an old um, route. 2010, so... But it still looks very good though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does look very good. Right, and get that up to 40. Oh, you have to sort of find the right setting for it, otherwise it disagrees with you. Bring that down a bit. You've got to find that right setting, otherwise the train will come to a stop, which usually is what happens on uh, on our journeys. That sounds better, it's, it's working. It is working up there. Yeah, we're accelerating nicely. But yeah, it's going to be a challenge when Steam does come to train the world. I reckon they have probably some sort of simple controls, but then at the same time have some um, sort of complex controls. Obviously there's going to be new players as well, and I suppose they sort of have to make it easy for new players, but also sort of complex so people already know how to operate Steam. So uh, I thought I can almost something like that. Sort of an easier mode, but then a harder mode as well. well that's not doing a lot at the moment. There we go, that's better. Oh no, not that. 
There we go. I think the Mark 1s we've got on the back there. Look at that though. Cool. Let's get back into the front. Slowly building that speed up. Actually, not anymore. No, no, that's not like that. Just gotta get it just right. What's it gonna like? Just like that. Get down a bit. So I'm not too good in these. Bad things usually do happen, so. Okay, hey, that's all good. That's probably because we're going down here as well, that's helping out a bit. Turn up to a tunnel. Very long tunnel and now a tunnel as well. Got a coast set as we're going through, I'm also going down here as well. I think it's about 25 minutes this scenario down to Falmouth. Yeah, this is what is beyond Truro. I'm not really too sure what we are supposed to be keeping sort of together. I guess keep it all in the green. Here we go, through the tunnel. Out we go. Cool. Well, that sounds brilliant, doesn't it? Give it a break some. See how good they are. Yeah, they're not too bad. Looks like it is downhill most of the way. I mean, we're going to be heading down towards sea level, I guess. And at that point, you are fairly high up, so. Cool, let's get another, uh, another flyby shot without trying to speed. It's no one else, we'll probably end up speeding a little bit. There we go. Cool. Yeah, it would be cool to see the Falmouth branch in the game though, and train some world too. It's that little 11 mile extension. Well, I suppose it's not really little, is it? 11 miles. A little bit of throttle. Just a bit of stuff a little bit. That seems to be very much liking that. So as we are going down here as well, so that would make sense. I'm not sure what that uh, tapping sound is. I'm not sure it's nothing bad. I think it might just be the wheels actually. Things going round. Yeah, it's got to be that, hasn't it? Oh, well, we've got a little vibe up coming up. That'll be a. Uh, Screenshot. If we can get there on time, that would be a nice screenshot and try not to slow down too much. Cool. Yeah, definitely worth picking it up whilst it is so cheap. Trying to agree on with us there slightly. Not bad. Going up on a 30. Brilliant route though. Oh, brilliant train as well. Yeah, 2010 this route is. It's not, you know, bad in any way, is it? Come down to 30. We've got the clear, so we're going through the right hand side, I think. Let's go along to and watch this go through. Hair and well. Cool. Where we go? Look at that. 
Goes back up to 40, I'm guessing that is the branch line speed the whole way. It's back downhill by the looks of things. And we do have a fairly steep gradient coming up after that. Barton Hall. One of the first locomotives is still around today. Alright, let's uh, get that up. What time are we due in there? Uh, we're doing that 56, we've got 7 miles. Get back in. Of course, so the Coleman's putting coal in, which I'm guessing in the Train Small 2 version. Uh, they're probably an auto farming. Unless maybe you sort of had a shovel, you clicked it, filled up the coal, and then it. And I was floated, then you put there, puts it in maybe. That could be something what happens. It probably would be something like that, wouldn't it? Where you click a, I know, there's like a shovel, there's a shovel, you click on it, it then hovers with coal in it, and then you click onto the, um, onto here, and it um, opens up and shoves the coal in. Some sort of little animation or something. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see how it works out. We have a fairly steep incline at the moment and as we make our way up to another tunnel. Look at that. Awesome. Very narrow tunnels on this route. Let's get back in. They're yeah, thoroughly enjoying it. Probably one of the best uh, payments I've made for uh, Train Sim. Because, yeah, steam. Oh, it's not liking it. It's not liking much of it. Oh, it's fairly steep coming up here, so we don't want to screw it up. There you go, it's, it's liking that. It's liking that. It's all good at the moment. So I wonder if there's another station along here. There's like some sort of village coming up, so might be a station. Yeah, just enjoying that. I miss it. Where's the whistle thing on here? See it going down. I think so. Oh, another good uh, location to watch the train going by. So you got the old ride up there or something. Another bridge there. Yeah, what's this other bit here? Yeah, some more sort of old bridge. Which you can see used to be there. Yeah, it sounds like there's a bit of speed now. It's pretty steep up there. Like it, not liking it. Maybe the regulator down a little bit. Just got to get it right in there. No, it didn't like that. There you go, like that. Oh, it did for a second. As we make our way up. We had a crash there, but luckily not. Sort of liking it much. Get down a little bit more. Right, almost going to be going downhill again, so that's all good. Saved from disaster. Look at that Proper steam engine. See coming out of there. Right, so I think we're going back down now. Now we're doing to Falmouth at 55, so about 10 minutes, and that is in 4 miles, so probably actually before that we're actually end up getting there, I would imagine. Cool. 
coaster coming down here, no point speeding up. Yeah, if you are enjoying the video, feel free to uh, leave a thumbs up and uh, do subscribe if you do want to see more. When Steam does come to Train Sim World, I'm sure we'll be right on it. I don't know how good we'll be at it, but yeah. Probably end up somehow blowing the steam engine up. So I wonder what type of steam engine we'll get. I'm thinking it'll be like a little pannier tank or something, you know, to sort of slowly ease, um, you know, slowly get, well, I suppose sort of slowly work into steam, if you sort of get what I mean. So I wonder if we'll start off like a little tanker or something. So we've got another station coming up, and we've got 39, uh, 30 as well. Do. Not sure what we're coming up on now. Oh, we got another train here. Look at that, I love the little tanker. I suppose maybe we'll get something like that. You know, a little tanker to sort of begin with. It could even be the Falmouth branch. Seems like ideal, you know, little trains, about 10, 11 miles. I don't know if we'll see anything major begin with. And there we go. Oh, a little bit over the limit, sorry. Uh oh. Then let's just sneak down here. Look at this. Another viaduct coming up, quite a few on this route it seems. So it's sort of following the valley. Seems to be more of those uh, stilts there, like an old past viaduct. There we go, let's get back in. It's 40 again, oh my god, we have got a steep gradient, look at this coming up here, wow. I really need to get the steam engine up the top. Well, you can tell we're coming up to Falmouth. Um, oh. Uh, what's that? <laughs> okay, I thought that was the game bugging out there. I think it's something down there going on. I hope. I hope it's not the train. That's quite cool. So how many miles have we got then? We've got uh, 2.5, uh, so we're doing uh, 54, so about 6 minutes. I'm guessing after this it probably is downhill most of the way. It's not liking it again. It's not agreeing with us. That sounds good. There you go, it's enjoying that. We're getting more cold in there, which is fair enough. We're probably burning quite a bit at this rate. We can make our way up. You can see the old wires as well, where the signal when we call them to operate all the stuff. Brilliant, let's get another fly by shot. We've got a very steep gradient coming up. So it's quite up and down this bit. Oh, we yeah. go. Cool. What a beautiful loco, though. I still can't believe that this is a route from 2010 and it, it looks very good still. Another station along it. In there. 
looks similar to the station, which is, um, oh, what is it? Uh, Good night, Mr. Tom. That looks similar to the one which was um, in that. Vivid memory of it, but it looks similar. Yeah, Good night, Mr. Tom. I don't know if anyone's watched that here, probably. The station and that looks similar to that one there. Maybe it is, I don't know. Yeah, I think I can see Falmouth coming up on our distance graph. As it's, uh, yeah, just about one, just over one mile. Cool. And there's the sea. Got the little boats down there, right? What a lovely bunch, though. Yeah, £3.99. If you don't have it, highly recommend it. I mean, this is my first time seeing this, and uh, yes, very happy. I think you get three locos as well. You get this one, there's the little, well, the other one we saw, then there's an even smaller one. I think it operates in the docks area. Yeah, I wonder if there's a modern day version of this, though. Hey, here we are, come into Falmouth. Yeah, it was a good journey that was, enjoyed that. For a 2010 route, I mean, I mean, it almost looks like a modern route to be honest. And there is no passenger cam, which sort of, you know, that is, mm. but yeah, that's not bad at all. Yeah, we're not up them in electric multiple units, Joe. Bring that down. Here we are. Right, this is where we want to not let them fail. Station. I don't really matter how far we get to the buffers, I mean the whole train's in the platform, so it'd probably actually be easier not to go up to the buffers. Here we are, this is Falmouth. Arriving a few minutes early as well. Well I think that was an amazing journey that was that was uh, very, very good. Uh, but hopefully everyone has enjoyed that. Um yeah, that, that was good, that was. Let's try and get a screenshot as well um, of the train lined up there. That's not too bad. Just as a personal uh, screenshot. There we go. Well, that is going to be everyone for today's uh, train simulator scenario and today's train simulator video. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. You'll find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. But yes, the spirit of Steam hype continues. Uh, and I hope you'll see you in the next one. See you all and take care. Bye, guys. Yeah.